Hidden Object Guru here with Haunt New Game, the Persistence Enhanced Edition. Now, the difference between this one uh, and previous versions of the Persistence is this is not VR and is available only on the PS5. So apparently they have done huge graphical upgrades, but it's not VR anymore. Let's give it a look. Nothing prepares you for deep space. Okay. The vastness of it all. Some say it makes them feel small. Meh. Insignificant. I see that. I can't say I share that feeling. I helped make this ship. Okay. The Persistence. Aww. She feels like mine. What a nice name All for a boat. Time. I mean, ship. Wink. Would anyone feel insignificant next to that possibility? Aww. Well, that's not I good. Hope to save her. To save myself. Okay. Is it me, the person you're waking out of cryostasis? Make a, make a person. Shape flesh from their genetic pattern. Oh, you're building a clone. To a digital copy of their mind. Nice. If anyone is going to escape the persistence alive. It is going to depend on this person I am bringing back to life. So who are you bringing back to life? Oh, thanks. On you, who am I there? Who am I though? Together, we have to keep going. We have to persist. It's time to go. Get it? Because keep going means persist, and it's the persistence. No, okay. I thought it was clever. What's that? You didn't this think it was clever? I'm just lying. This body feels like it was just printed. It was. <gasps> Zimri, you don't know how good it is to hear from you. Can I get a flashlight? Your muscles are going to be stiff. So make sure you look around. Move your head about, please. Can I turn down the sensitivity? Because that would be ideal. Oh, you want me to look at the lights just like we're back in, uh... Okay. Just like we're back in, uh, Halo. I would love to do that. Tell me more about these blast shutters. Matt Purge... Just gonna quickly check the controls. Uh, quint quick interaction. Tap shield. What is all this jive? So there's no, like, sensitivity. Comfort options? Okay. Alright, motion aim sensitivity. Nice. Add scale aim assist. It's weird that they call them comfort options, because that's... What is assist mode? Okay. Yeah, obviously. All right. Ooh, nice. Okay. No, no, that's fine. I'm sure I'm fine with the, uh... Nope. wonder what the teleporting is going to be. Aww. Nice. There was a spark gap event on the last singularity jump. Well, that doesn't sound good. Yes, of course. Black hole. Where the hell are we, Serena? Really good question. The deck building is out. I need you to recover a data module from the storm. I'll unlock the door for you. Thank you. You know, this is my second um PlayStation 5 controller. And in both of them, the X button has started going out, like, a week after I bought it. I'm getting to feel like this isn't a very good controller. Fab chips! Nice. Microport, are you say? Okay. Oh, I see. It's, uh, just like the... What do you call it? Just like Blink from, uh... Can't go through there yet. Sorry, as I was saying, just like Blink from my beloved Dishonored. Okay. Corpses everywhere, just way too many corpses. Constantly corpsing around, corpsing off, corpse city, corpse, corpse, corpse. That's me. Yeah. How do I how can I tell that that's me? I can't see anything. 
Now, how do I pick this up? Or can I pick that up? It's like a key card of some kind. So how do I pick things up? Ah! Oh God! Oof. Ew. It's just you and me, I'm afraid. We're the last survivors. So I can't pick that up. The data module is right next to your old body. You can't miss it. Okay. That's the data module we need. Right. It was a plot thing. Put that into the dead portal in the other room, please. Oof. This place does not look great. All right, what have we here? I desperately need a flashlight. I cannot stress that enough. What button? I didn't see any button displayed. Master deck porter, gotcha. So now I have to wait for that to recharge before I can teleport again. Hence, unlimited teleporting. Retrace your steps to where we started. The dead portal is right next to the clone printer. Yeah, I know. Uh, okay, set the master deck porter, deck one research. Start to, uh, okay. Ooh. Uh-oh. Oh, dark matter. I already did that, didn't I? Murder. And it turned everyone in the ship onto zombies. But the auxiliary. Well, it's printing bodies. But they aren't human. I need you to be strong, Zuri. Probably should have listened to the rest of that. The portal is set to the new day. Flashlight! That flashlight sucks. Finally, you tell me my inventory. Sink harvester, stem cell boost, har 17 percent harvest rate, data module. Okay. What have we here? Well, that's a zombie. Watch yourself. There's one of them ahead. I see it. You need to creep up carefully from behind. Crouch if you have to. If you can inject a dart from your harvester at the back of the neck, you can extract some high-quality stem cells from its spinal cord. And also shut it down at the same time? <laughs> well, that was horrible. Ew. What is that thing? Ooh, fab chips, nice. More stem cells. I do I mod myself? Do I just use that to rebuild myself? Is there a shield in this suit? Yes, but it only lasts a moment. You have to time your party carefully. Where is the shield? Now you just have to time your attack. What do you mean my attack? Oh, I see. Come on. How many times do I have to club this dude? That many, apparently. I 100% did not know. I was planning on using stealth. Nice. Armory fabricator. Oh, hell yes. More stem cells. Nice that I just automatically pick up everything by looking at it. That is a good touch, and it makes it very convenient. I will say the game looks good. Is this Unreal Engine? Priority. Iris is on this deck. You could head over to her and get the jump vectors calculated. Understood. Nice. Watch yourself, please. Those things are out there, and they are out for your blood. Are they, though? Do they need my blood for something, or are you just being clever? 
I don't understand why I couldn't harvest any stem, cell, stem cells from the guy I wrecked. It really doesn't last long, but, you know, as long as they keep telegraphing their moves. I'm sure I'll be fine. And I can't use this on this guy. Objective 1, calculate jump vector simulation. Okay, such a research deck. Iris, the system is required to plot a course with a singularity jump without which... Okay. What is that bank there? Oh, that's my inventory, but they called it a bank for reasons that elude me. Let's check out the map. I am here. I want to get where? And that's where I'll come back if I die. Okay, so I need to get... Very far! Melee Fabricator. Oh, yes, please. I'd prefer ranged Fabricators because I'm a coward. But, you know. Yes, I do. You can use any Erebus tokens you find to unlock and upgrade weapons at these Fabricators. All right. Sentinel, Needle, Storm Fury, you say. Hmm. I have five and I need one. Retro starts turn for six stop power expense of ammunition capacity and reload time. Okay. Uh, high rate of fire, large ammunition capacity, limited potency. Power and capacity, sentinel standard equipment for security personnel. Ooh, that sounds amazing. Let's go with the basic pistol for now and then we'll go from there. So I would like you to make me one of those, please. Thank you. That's the harvester. Data module. And so no aim button. So were this VR, I would actually be pointing and shooting that. You're making me real curious. Real curious? Quite curious about the non-VR version of this. Do you think the uh, PS4 version came with my... Uh, PS5 version, which, thank you publishers for sending that along. As you can tell, I'm very intrigued by how well this is going. Oh, nice. Alright. Got a good feeling about this, he said. Hoping to hide his abject terror. Terror. Terroir. No, wait, that was that wine game I wasn't interested in. It's pitch black here. Yes, I know. Well, uh, there's a monster. I heard it. Maybe he's facing the wrong way, and I'll get lucky. What a cute robot! Okay. Quickly get out the stem selenator. I can't see anything. Nope. It's okay, buddy. Oh. Whew. All right, I think we're clear. I didn't hear any more than one of them. Okay, hate doing that in the dark. Oh, we're in some sort of exercise room. Didn't even realize. Let me go check out that toy robot. I can't get the toy robot? Well, that's disappointment. At least there's a bunch of health flying around. Cash. Delicious cash. I know they're fabricator chips, but come on. We know they're actually space bucks. Oh, cool. You got a club for me? Alright, so Ride Baton, Lance. Peacekeeper, tell me more. Ooh. 
Oh, so it's going to break right away. Nice. What? Oh, crap. All right, well. That actually sounds like a lot of fun. So wait, it's going to cost me... S what is that six tokens about, and how do I upgrade items? Wait, it only has six uses before it explodes? Or do I not understand how this game's... Uh, inventory degradation system works. Everybody, let's be very quiet. There could be some boogans around. In fact, in all likelihood, there are. Okay, I hear a boogans right now. Anybody else? Oh. You automatically take out your stem cell harvester. Nice. Whew. Getting some wicked power spikes near where you are. What should I look for? Well, I'm hearing a monster ahead of me. Any powered system could blow up under the wrong conditions. Even a hatch motor. Oh. Just be careful. So maybe don't open the hatch motors right away. Gotcha. Well, open the hatches right away. I'm very nervous right now. Also, why are people keeping all these stem cells lying around? Seems like a weird choice. Should I have checked down there? You know what? I'm sure the plot will move. Grenade fabricator. Fun. Supply crate. Yeah, let's let's go for the plot thing first. I was about to say, is that a church? No, different kind of crossover. Okay, that's two monsters. Is that guy missing half of his head? I think that guy might be missing half of his head. Uh, yeah, half of his head was missing. Now let's very slowly creep up on this bad boy. Well, he's off somewhere. Hey, buddy. Oh, he spun around and I got to finish him off. That's fantastic. Oh, God. Okay, that made me nervous. What are the odds that he saw me? Not as good as you'd think. All right. You cannot open doors when crouched. Lesson learned. Oh, you also don't have to hold down the button. Ow. Okay, I switched off of my uh, weapon. Uh, hey, let's try out that pistol, shall we? That was bad. Apparently the pistol was not a good choice. Are we able to gonna are we gonna be able to 3D print other characters? If so, can I just say what? 
And do I get to keep my equipment? No, I don't. You say that, but... What? No one told me they were going to be twisting the ship around. Okay. Well, that sucked. Now, lesson learned. So it's a roguelite. Weird way to find out it was a roguelite. That's right, I'm a sneaky coward. That is 100% my brand. Ah. So what are we going to do with all these stem cells? He asked. Oh, damn. This is nonsense I don't understand. So I'm here and I need to get... So much farther than I did last time. Oh my god. Let's go get a weapon. Wow. Hey, at least I get to keep all of the DNA and uh, stem cells I found, right? Yes, I do. So, will the stem cells unlock new characters, new abilities? Nice. I wonder how you level up weapons. Am I going to find, like, a weapon mod station? Or will I just unlock that ability at the uh, Erebus station at some point? See, I hear somebody, but I didn't see anybody when I did this. Oh, there he is. Let's see if there's anybody else backing him up. Doesn't look like it. Ah, crap. Okay, this is bad. Oh. Put up that shield way too early. Oh, she gets a 25% armory discount. Nice. And each one will have a different perk. Not dead, remember? You just lost your original body. But yes, chances are that's what took you out last time. Oof. You don't sound certain. There's some nasty things. Uh, gear suits. Stem cell harvester. Okay, how do I improve it? Okay, that's great. Force field. Okay. Okay, so I can't actually do anything yet. How do I, uh... Vampire, nice. Out in the shadows. Maybe I need to find blueprints, or...? But that doesn't matter now. All that matters is that we're going to get through this. And we're going to get out of here. I like your attitude, lady. I have no faith that I can pull off what you want me to do, but... I like your attitude. All right, I'm ready. Oh, come on. I timed that right. What? Come on. You didn't tell me my force field only had three chart four charges. That seemed well, no, it's not unfair, but it seems annoying. I'm real bad at getting uh what just happened? It could be expanded if you can find some additional deck modules. Okay. That's great, but I seem to not be able to move. So let's just uh, exit game and come back. No, really? The f okay, that's weird. The really weird part, though, is that she was 
telling me something that sounded important. Expanded deck modules? What does that mean? I didn't even go through a teleporter this time. I just wound up back here. Okay, here we go. Someone's planted a silent grenade near your position. A booby trap? Something like that. The captain and the exec both took some extreme steps to defend their positions. Okay. Well, there he is. Anybody else? Yeah, I figured he was almost done looking at that. Three, two, one, and boom. Ew. You know, I'd be very interested to play this in VR, but not with handheld controls. I'd be very interested to play it with uh, the controller. Because there's a lot of stuff that needs you need to do. And a lot of buttons to keep track of. I think what more games need to do is look at what um, Resident Evil 7 did. And instead of trying to cram all of these functions onto a, uh, a VR controller, just let me play the game with a controller. Like, the controller can make me move easily, turn easily. You don't have to let me look up and down. I can handle that myself. And then, when I aim, when I shoot, I just get a reticle at the center of my screen, and I shoot at the reticle. Because I was playing uh, Hitman VR, which should be fantastic. It should be the best Hitman version ever made, right? But, and this is the key part, I would very much like a weapon. Uh, and this is the key part. i got to be more careful than I'm being... Uh, they want you to aim, like you're using a controller to play the game, but rather than just letting you aim with where you're looking, like a sensible game, they want you to hold up your controller awkwardly and aim with the light bar on your PS4 controller. To which I say, that's maybe the dumbest idea I've ever heard. And spoiler alert, it plays terribly. And what I don't get about it is, this is something that like... Other developers have already figured out? Like, this isn't something they needed to event, invent. Resident Evil 7 already demonstrated that controlling VR uh, with a controller and a headset and aiming by looking is the optimal way to do this. Because they managed, Capcom managed to create a game that freaking everybody loves. Was that super noisy? Did that wake up the other guy? Amazingly, no. Ah, crap. I think he saw me. Okay, now I'm gonna run away. Oh, wait, there's no run button. Or if there is, I don't know about it. Okay, not a problem. Let that recharge. Oh, thank you for dying. Alright, what can I... Uh... Uh, okay, escape artist. What does that mean? Grav hook. Ooh, that sounds fun. Rage serum. Switch to upgrade mode. Upgrade mode. Okay, that's embarrassing. Alright, so what about grav hook? What is that? Weaponized gravity device. Lift enemies to the end and smash them on the ground. I do like the sound of that. Escape artist. Uh, escape soon, death instant, tell me nice. Favorite Cobra Dots team, temporal effect, and then rendering them in the scene. Time warp. Slow down time. Nice. Reaper. What? Definitely going to be playing around that with that later. Oh my god, all of these sounds great. Ah, but I want to try the grab hook. Oh, it costs almost nothing. Nice. That's handy. So I just... You know that you're not displaying... Ah, there we go. Alright. Whew. Cannot wait to try this bad boy out. 
So how do I refresh the ammo for it? Will there be ammo stations, or do I have to, like, go back to a thing? Alright, let's go. Yeah, all I'm saying is it's like, other developers, better developers in this case, have figured out the best way to handle first-person shooting, or really all interaction in VR. Just let me look at it, and then press a button on my controller. For any complicated game, like a Resident Evil, or a Hitman, or a The Persistence, I'm gonna need more buttons than VR controllers give me. And that's fine! Instead of like, oh well, push different parts on the touchpad to do different things. No, just let me use my Xbox controller. Oh no, it'll break immersion. I know I'm playing a video game, and I know those aren't really my hands, okay? Let me, instead of failing to provide me with a real experience, which is what's happening right now, let me have an entertaining and satisfying experience. Okay, where is that guy? Oh, crap, he saw me. Did he wake up his friend? Okay, that was cute. Didn't really work, but... Well, I enjoyed it while it lasted. Really wish I had killed those guys more effectively, but... Ah, what are you gonna do? So if I spend armory chips to upgrade a thing, next time I buy it, will it start out upgraded, or do I have to upgrade it over and over and over again every time I buy one? Because I'm not psyched at that prospect. Alright, let's find out with the melee fabricator right now. Seriously, how is there no run? I mean, I can teleport, but that's not the same thing. Oh, wow, that was disorienting. Uh, yes, I would very much like the riot baton. Alright, now let's see about upgrading it. Do you mean baton? Because it kind of sounded like you said button there. And I don't think it's a riot button. Panels here are overloaded. Keep a wide berth from any that are arcing with electricity. I see those. Okay, this is bad. Thank you for that DNA. Well, that was risky. I'll say this about the developers. They have crafted themselves some incredibly tense combat. So, more power to you guys. I want to see about upgrading the thing I'm already holding. Or does it just upgrade future ones I print? Well, we're going to find out. Upgrade to switch to fabricator. Okay. Okay, so. If I want to upgrade the riot baton... Goes from 6 power to 8 power at the cost of 2 tokens. 8 to 10. Okay. Nice. Well, this is just handy. Wait, it's called Ivy Serum and it puts people on your side? Is that seriously a Poison Ivy reference? You know, from Batman? This game is delightful. Okay. Maybe stay away from those panels. Oh, I don't like that sound. Sounds like we got some monsters about. And so next time I uh, generate one of these things, it's going to come with higher... Uh... Uh, there we go. The Jeffrey's Tube. Will get me there. Hopefully. Or maybe not. Maybe it'll take me back exactly the way I came. Uh, okay. That wasn't helpful. So I was trying to find a way around these shocking panels, and you just took me back the other way. Okay. I didn't get electrocuted, everybody. Living the dream. It's, uh... Things have gone all pear-shaped. 
when I find out that I, uh, my big win. Oh, I didn't like that sound. Uh, sorry, where my big win is not getting electrocuted to death. Ah! Jesus! Who the hell is shooting at me? Never even saw the guy! I wasted all that money on guns. Very mad at myself right now. Listeners are extremely sensitive to movement. You think? So porting between cover might be a good defense next time. Thanks. Good to know. Hey, do you know when that would have been better to know? Before I got murdered by one. Anyway, uh, we're going to wrap it up here. This game is unbelievably tense. Way to go, developers. You've really done an excellent job creating a truly, effectively tense environment. Like, chef's kiss. Amazing work. Ah, uh, stem cells I found in a toilet. Good work, game. Uh, seriously, though, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. I'd like to thank you for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that coming up. Questions, suggestions, related whatnots, go in the comment section below the video. I'm going to see you back here. Where's he going? Uh, for more new and or upcoming games. I think he was looking for me. It didn't go well. Uh, yes, back here for more new and or upcoming games. But until then, I'm going to say that's right. Au revoir.